सो हाउ टू अपडेट दी डीवीआर फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल जस्ट डाउनलोड दी रिक्वायर्ड फॉर्मवेयर एंड दी एफटीपी टीएफटीपी टूल फ्रॉम दिस मेंशन लिंक व्हिच वी ऑलरेडी शेयर्ड विद यू ऑन बाय ईमेल जस्ट कॉपी दिस लिंक ओपन एनी ब्राउजर गो टू दी फॉर्मवेयर टू दी डायरेक्टरी द डीवीआर choose the firmware as per the the model number like for example 7208 hvish just click save also download the tftp tool from this link Then go to back just try to close that one just just updating tool TFTP, just save. so after download uh, the next step is connect the dvr directly to your uh, laptop or ma any machine using the lan cable directly so once it will download so we can uh, connect dvr directly to this system also all uh, the firmwares are available in uh, this link so for 7172 series sl and sh series with 73 series all the model number list we mention here so for means the first the file 1 supports this type this model numbers file 2 support this model numbers file 3 support this model number and same for the the fourth point so we categorize into 1 2 3 4 <laughs> folders so you can choose the right firmware from this and you can update uh, your system by yourself same for the 71 series so we mentioned the 71 series the, the firmware Four seven two seven seven two four channel eight channel sixteen channel HVASH. The firmware is this one. So you can choose the the right firmware from this link, and so you can update successfully. So let me check how much percent it still pending. Once download uh, will finish, we have to connect the DVR directly to your uh, the machine. Three more minutes to go.
नेक्स्ट स्टेप इज कनेक्ट द डी वी आर डायरेक्टली टू दी पी सी एंड ऑल्सो दी कॉपी द टी एफ टी पी फोल्डर विच यू डाउनलोड फ्रॉम दिस एफ टी पी टू एनी डी ड्राइव और सी ड्राइव फॉर एग्जाम्पल लेट्स टेक द डी ड्राइव almost complete so the firmware download complete so now we can uh, we have to connect the dvr directly to your uh, uh, the system or p any uh, pc so even we can disconnect it through through from internet this connect dvr directly to the pc the next step is copy the tftp folder to any d drive so this tftp copy to any like for example d drive extract it paste into the local drive and ex extract using win rr the next step is put the firmware in under the tftp folder so the firmware which we download let's digicap copy to this tftp folder copy this to tftp folder now next is set your ip computer computer ip to 192.0.0.128 close double click the tftp tftp server dot exe under the tftp folder run power on the dvr device will detect the firmware automatically power on the dvr so it will detect automatically so from where will start upgrading connecting connecting to client success means your machine successfully connected to the dvr and completed means the firmware has been completely successfully done and upgraded so now dvr will restart automatically after the upgrade and shut down the tftp before dvr power on again so just close this tftp and uh, using this step you can configure you can update the dvr also you can maintain the multiple machines to update the multiple uh, dvr simultaneously If still any uh, support is required, you can contact to the technical support. Board line numbers.
थैंक यू